ever try me, you know you will get dealt. I know that I'm the best, that's why I'm feeling myself. Competition, I be giving up. Hell, I'm focused, I'm focused, yeah. Close the coffin and just put in a nail. And if you're up against me, then you're gonna need help. You can run and hide, but who you gonna tell? I'm focused, I'm focused, yeah. Yo, what is up, 4NL Nation? AI, the month mechanic, coming back to you live. And we're going to do a quick update on my roster so I can show you guys my roster and kind of some of the updates I've done and reason why you see uh, a lot of my cards, a lot of my coins. Uh, you know, my coin vault is a little, little bit low. So let's look and see what I purchased. So on, I think on offense, I'm pretty much the same. Uh, you guys are the same crew. Nothing changed on offense. Uh, this week, is, is I put an emphasis on defense. I'm really trying to get defensive cards. So, right off the bat, uh, uh, do a shot for it. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, well, we'll be all right. I picked up Ed Reed, free safety. Uh, I still got Glover Queen on the squad. I use him in certain uh, formations. We got Ed Reed. Uh, I picked up... Um, Bobby Wagner, I picked up Terrell Suggs, I picked up a Jamie Collins just to solidify the, the linebacker position in case anyone gets tired. Um, we picked up this Darnell Dockett. We used to have, uh, what was his name? Who did we have? We had Bennett. We had Bennett, but we I switched to this Dockett because he's a little bit faster and a little bit stronger, well, way stronger actually. And that's how we're going to work with that. Uh, I picked up this, um, what is his name? Byron Maxwell. Yeah, Byron Maxwell. He's pretty solid, man. I love this new Byron Maxwell card. He can help fill the void uh, for some of my other corners. And is that it? I think that might be it. Did we pick up anybody on offense? I want to say we didn't. We didn't pick up anybody on offense. No. Offense will be next week. We're gonna pick up some players for offense next week. This week, I'm focusing on defense. I'm, I'm think, I'm not sure, but I might want to get that 95 overall. Mean Joe Green. He's going for about 200 right now, but I'm really in the sweepstakes of getting another corner to complement my Richard Sherman. I'm thinking about picking up that um, Charles Woodson 97 overall card. He goes for about 700, seven, uh, about 750k. But I don't know, that's a lot of money to spend for a card, but he definitely could replace his Patrick Peterson card. And I think he'll be a compliment to Richard Sherman. The thing is, if I'm paying like 800K for a card, I might as well just wait and save up and see if we can get that um, that 99 overall Richard Sherman. What do you guys think about that? You think I need, you guys think I need to save up and get that Charles Woodson to be different? Or do you think I need to just kind of wait a little bit and maybe pick up that 99 overall Richard Sherman? Now he's two inches taller, of course. Uh, speed is uh, is about the same. The only difference between the two cards is strength, and that Charles Woodson will not drop, be dropping any picks. <laughs> I think he has an 88 catch or something like that. So I don't know. I'm, it's one of those things where if I get Charles Woodson now, right? If I get Charles Woodson now. I'll get him, and the only other corner I would want would be either Richard Sherman or Night Train Lane at this point in time. So, I don't know. I don't know. Decisions, decisions, right? Um, but, yeah, that's the main two. P oh, yeah. We got this 97 Luke Keekly. I had the 95 overall for the, for the longest, and we went ahead and go ahead and switch it up and bought the uh, 97 Luke Keekly to kind of solidify the middle because, you know, I just it was only right. I feel like it was right, but. Yeah, this week is defense. I'm going to try to mean Joe Green out and see how he does. And hopefully we can get that Charles Woodson or the 99 overall Richard Sherman. Uh, depends what you guys tell me I need to pick up. Also, I want to pick up the new um, the new Carlos Rogers card, man. Have you guys seen that card? The new Carlos Rogers? Let's look at it real quick. Now, his catching is, is a beast. We're not going to lie. He can't catch worth a damn, but... Let's check these stats out, though. I really want that card, man. It's two cards I want. It's cornerbacks on the defensive side. It's two cards I want. 
What were we looking at? We were looking at the Quentin Dempsey. Uh, his cornerback. He's a 90, um, 95. Uh, I think it's a flashback, actually. A flashback card. Yeah, there you go. Look, look, they're going to Charles Woodson. Look at all these cards. All these cards I actually want. Now, the Carlos Rogers is a beast card. I mean, look at that. Let's look at it real quick. 68 strength, speed 94, acceleration 95, awareness 90. He can't catch, which is a, it's a minus, but I, you don't have to really catch. He can tackle a little bit. Look at that jump, though. 94, he's a six foot. Um, but look, power moves, swim moves, he can't block shit. His pursuit is really good. I really like a, a cornerback that can pursue. Um, look at that play rec, though. 95 play rec. He could definitely get some game in my slot position. Uh, 96 zone coverage, 95 stamina. Ah, I want to get him, but look, this Talib is so nice as well. 95 speed. You know, you guys know I love Talib. His play rec isn't where I want it to be, but he's 6'1. Ah, but you know, I don't know. I want that color. I don't need him. I just, I, sometimes I buy cards and I don't really need them, but I just want them. Like, you know, I didn't really need the Ed Reed, but I wanted him, right? I think Ed Reed is that dynamic. And I just wanted him because I love Ed Reed. So we'll see. This week is this is all about defense this week. What do you guys think? What cards do you think I need to add to the squad uh, on defense since we're talking about defense? Week? Oh, also, I changed my chemistry in case you guys didn't, didn't notice. I went, I had to get an offense, offensive chemistry because we were having troubles running the ball. You guys know I love to run the ball. So I went to a, a short run, and I still got the zone defense chemistry. And we got uh, Jimmy Johnson is the coach for that. And a Jimmy Johnson is not a bad car if you guys actually like this chemistry. Uh, he adds uh, two agility and two hit power to the whole team. Plus two hit power is a lot. I mean, we already got Atwater. He's 98. That makes him 100. Uh, Ed Reed is 94. That makes him 96. And all the other players, that's 97, 96. That makes them 98, 99 hit power. So we got hitters on the squad all around. So that's it for this video. Just a rock, quick roster update for you guys. Uh, let me know your, your thoughts on who I should add to the squad, who's dynamic for you, who's working for you, and who I need to start saving my coins up to get. It's, that's been another video. I'm AI the Mutt Mechanic. I'll catch you guys on the next video, 131, and I'm out. Peace.